Hey, what's up everyone? It's Steven here, and welcome to another weekly LEGO Deals. For the week of April 14th, 2024. And the LEGO Deals are slowing down this week as compared to last week, as the Target Circle Week sale is over. However, at Walmart and Best Buy, they still have several of their clearance sets still available. Plus, over at Macy's, they actually have nearly 200 sets on sale for about 15% off. And in the Lego Coming Soon section, we talk about some new Lego Dream sets that are coming this summer. But as always though, if you end up liking this video, or if you just want to support the channel, consider giving this video a thumbs up for subscribing but let's not waste any more time and let's jump right into those deals. And as we do each week, let's start with the Lego shop and this week's gift with purchase, which at least for today, all of the gifts with purchase have sold out and there isn't anything. However, and once again, that should change tomorrow, April 15th. It is expected that we should be getting this fruit store set as a gift with purchase, which is a set very reminiscent of the Houses of the World sets from last year. It's anticipated that this set will be available as a gift with all purchases of $200 or more, though we'll have confirmation on that price threshold tomorrow. It's also likely we'll be getting a cheaper polybag gift with purchase in addition to this set. Now, moving on to the actual Lego deals for the week. And this week, we're actually gonna start over at Best Buy, where again, and as I mentioned in the beginning, they still have several clearance sets and sale sets available, which is 44 as of at least this morning. Starting with the Lego City Dunk Stunt Ramp Challenge, which you can get for $14, so over 50% off down from $30. The Lego City Water Police Detective Missions, also over 50% off at $19, down from $40. The Lego City Smashing Chimpanzee Stunt Loop for $32. However, wait for a little bit. Walmart has an even better clearance deal on this set. Then the Lego Super Mario Big Spikes Cloud Top Challenge Expansion, which is $39, down from $70, so about 40% off. The Lego Duplo Town Caring for Animals at the Farm set is 20% off, and you can get it for $40, down from $50. Then there's the Lego Super Mario Creativity Toolbox. I mentioned this before. It's 25% off. You can get it for $45. Then the Lego City Police Prison Island set is on sale again for 20% off. So you can get it for $80, down from $100. Then several Lego Dream sets are on sale, including the Zoe and Zion, the Cat Owl set, which you can get for 20% off and pick it up for $40 down from $50, though the Cat Owl is super creepy looking. The Fantastical Treehouse set is on sale for 20% off, and you can get it for $88 down from $110. And the Nightmare Shark ship is on sale for 20% off, so you can get it for $112 down from 140. Then if you're into the Lego modular sets, the Lego Icons Boutique Hotel is on sale for $28 off. So it's $202 down from $230, so a little over 10% off. Then there's the Lego Technic Lamborghini set. Again, I mentioned this from previously, it's $90 off, so you can get it for $360 down from 450. After that, we'll move over to Walmart and check out their deals this week. And like I mentioned when we were talking Best Buy, they have the Lego City Stunts Smashing Chimpanzee set on sale, and it's a great deal. It's $23 down from $70. So if you want this set, this is where to get it. Then they also have the retired Jurassic World Stygimolic, the Dinosaur Escape set for $24, down from $40. The Lego Disney Princess Jasmine and Mulan's Adventures is also $25, down from $40. And they have the Lego Harry Potter Hogwarts Room of Acquirement set for 20% off, and you can get it for $40. 
The Lego Friends Heart Lake International School is on sale for 20% off, and you can get it for $80 down from $100. Then moving over to Shop Disney. And they have a couple of sets that are on sale that you can find most places, but two of their best deals include the Lego Duplo Magical Castle, which is 40% off, so you can get it for $60 down from $100. Also, they have the Disney Princess Ultimate Adventure Castle for 30% off. So you can get that set for $70 down from $100. After that, we'll go over to Costco. And they have several deals online right now, including several combo deals, including the Tiny Plants and Daffodils bundle. So you can get both sets for $55. Then they can have where you can get two of the Bouquet of Roses sets for $90. And they have the Lego Treehouse set, which now costs $250. You can get it for $40 off and pick it up for $210. I will say, if Costco has anything in store, because remember, that's where they have the best deals, I haven't seen anything new for April at my local Costco, but if you guys happen to see anything, let us all know down in the comments below. And then after Costco, we have Macy's. And as I mentioned in the intro, Macy's is doing a big sale of nearly 200 Lego sets, and they're all for about 15% off. So a couple that I wanted to point out include the Star Wars Coruscant Guard Gunship, which you can get for $119 down from $140. And again, this isn't a set we see on sale very often. There's also the Lego Architecture The Great Pyramid of Giza set, which you can get for just a little over $110 down from $130. And there's the Lego City Express Passenger Train, which is $161. And the Lego Architecture Taj Mahal, which you can get for $102. There's the newer Lego Marvel Spider-Man vs. Sandman Battle Set, which you can get for $32, down from $38. And the Lego Duplo Treehouse, which you can get for $76, down from $90. And finally, I'll point out there's the Lego Ninjago Elemental Dragon set, which you can get for $110. This one is also on sale from $130. Then we'll finish this week's deals up with Amazon. And right now they have the Lego Disney Princess Cinderella and Prince Charming's Castle on sale for 33% off. So you can get it for just about $60 down from $90. Then they have the Lego Ideas BTS Dynamite set on sale for also about 33% off. So you can get it for just over $66, down from $100. Then for Lego Marvel, they have the in-game final battle set on sale for 30% off. So you can get it for just under $70, down from $100. And then for Lego Star Wars, they have the Mandalorian Fang Fighter versus TIE Interceptor on sale for essentially 9% off, so you can get it for $9 off at $91. So honestly, I'm just kind of pointing this out as it's starting to go on sale. And then finally for Amazon is the Lego Architecture Statue of Liberty set, which you can get on sale for $95, down from $120, so $25 off. And as we usually do, let's finish this week's video off with the Lego coming soon. And even though several more LEGO Star Wars sets were officially revealed, I've covered most of them ad nauseum at this point, other than maybe the Commander Cody Brickheads, but, you know, it's, it's a Brickhead, so it kind of is what it is. So instead, let's talk about some new LEGO Dreams sets that also happen to be coming in May or maybe August. There's kind of some conflicting information here versus the different retailers. And even though I'm not a huge Lego Dreams person, and it feels like that theme is sort of struggling, I actually kind of like a couple of these sets. So first we have a set, 71478, The Never Witch's Midnight Raven, which is a set that comes with 1,203 pieces, five minifigures, and is likely to retail for about $100. 
This one is actually probably my favorite and looks so heavily inspired by Baba Yaga from Slavic folklore. Now, instead of a witch's house on chicken legs like Baba Yaga's, you have the witch's house on the back of a giant brick-built raven. It's just kind of a cool aesthetic, if you ask me. Plus, as far as minifigures go, the Never Witch looks freaking amazing and just so evil. I just really like her minifig and is my favorite from this kind of entire little wave that they have here. Next up after that, we have Cooper's Robot Dinosaur C-Rex, which is set 71484, has 917 pieces, four minifigs, and will probably retail for $80. This is probably my second favorite set, and I'm the type of person that's spoiled, and I just generally prefer the molded Lego animals and creatures. I think that's why the Jurassic Park dinos are so popular. It's because they're molded figures, and therefore generally look really good. However, I don't mind this at all. And maybe it's because it's a robot dinosaur, so the brick-built nature of it just sort of fits. Lastly is set 71485, Mateo and Z-Blob the Knight Battle Mech. And honestly, my first thoughts on this one is that it looks heavily inspired from like 1980s, 1990s anime mechs. Despite that, I think I'm more down on this set just because we've gotten so many mechs from the Ninjago theme that personally, I'm just a little burned out on these. The set has 1,333 pieces, includes four minifigures, which feels light, and throwing in these other little figures just isn't the same especially for an anticipated $130 price point. All right, that's it for the LEGO deals and the LEGO coming soon this week. And at least for me, a little bit shorter video, but that's because there wasn't really as much going on this week. However, if there were any LEGO deals or anything in the LEGO coming soon that you were excited about, let's talk about it down in the comments below. But most of all, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. I really do appreciate it. And as always, I'll catch you next time.